campy matchup. Yeah, this should be a lot of fun. Uh, <laughs> Proton versus free Jun numbers. Yeah. Okay, Looney Tunes, of course. Uh, so, Proton gonna opt for the... Uh, not, not the Reflector down B, but like the Nest kind of Yeah, S1. yeah, yeah. That one's really good for Snake. Yeah, I'd imagine. He, he, can't, he can't use most of his B moves. And I know Me Gunner has some like confirms that uh, she didn't have in Smash 4 because Proton has like that PK fire thing and then it combos into a charge shot now, like guaranteed. Yeah, exactly. It's super good at ledge too because it lingers there. So uh, right now, both players have about even ground. It just all depends on who can get the advantage state first. Yeah. Louis Team's going to find us that the grenade, but going to get his health back, Proton. Yeah. It just seems from like the past two ledge interactions that Looney Tunes, like his grenade setups just won't work because if he does jump down B, it just doesn't work. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. He's just going to absorb it because uh, just not playing the matchup correctly yet. I'm sure he'll adapt and figure it out soon. Yeah. Eventually, you know, how much else can Proton get back before he realizes, you know? Yeah. I mean, I feel like he's only using the grenade, which is fine. I'm pretty sure the C4 gives him like way too much health and it he's like using the grenade and then like using a normal to stuff out like the the magnet so yeah. I, mean, I mean it's fine he took the first stock so yeah exactly after punishing uh, a lot of whiffs right there Proton gonna get the advantage state but Lucian's gonna go high yeah all right oh that was a really good block spring I like that it was so unique because you just, you just never see these kind of things from like me gunner in general but like not to mention the character is like super unorthodox so it's really interesting seeing what Proton can do and that F smash yeah. Uh, probably not what he wanted, being real. <laughs> no, he, he wanted the grenade to blow up after he F-smashed, but the grenade exploded on the platform. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't even yeah. see the grenade was there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, he got another ledge trap. Proton yeah. gonna go high. Yeah. Yeah, same thing with oh, him. He oh, he stuck, stuck him. him. Yeah, he stuck him. Oh, I was about to say, if he gets a stick, yeah. he could definitely just hold down the... Oh, I wanted to hold it for free, but hold it more than usual just to well, get the health Yeah, it, it's scary, because it, if he does back throw, it combos straight into... Yeah, the, yeah, assuming yeah. that like it doesn't stick back onto him. However, right now, Proton with 112%. Looney Tunes has an advantage right now. Like 50 more percent, and he'll be in the, the down throw true... Um, Up tilt. Yeah, true kill. But the Nikita gonna get it. That move yeah. is just so good at edge guarding, because the longer yeah. it stays out, the more damage it'll do, and the more powerful it becomes. Yeah. And there's just no risk to it, because you can cancel at any time, and you're not exposing yourself, because you can do it from a safe range. Yeah, exactly. It, it goes <laughs> super yeah. far distance. Ooh, Looney had a good idea there. He did F tilt one, and then he thought the grenade was gonna explode, so he put up his shield. Yeah, he held but, it. Uh, he he missed on the grenade a little. Oh, and again, Proton was stuck. Yeah, I don't think he realized. Yeah, sitting in shield a little too long. Yeah, definitely. Not to mention you have to like uh, look out for the noise. Proton down by a lot right now, 120 to 110, but stocks aren't even right now. And that up air is like very linear. Like it only covers like straight above him. So honestly, it might not be the best for covering Snake's uh, high recovery because he mixes in a lot yeah, of beer reverses. Yeah, he's gonna go like back and forth. Yeah, yeah. beer reverses. Yeah, you just said it. Ooh, oh, that was really smart, but not gonna find it. But look at the health back. But he oh, stuck him. Somehow. I didn't even see he stuck. He's yeah. been getting every stick. Wow. That was three. Yeah, because Ludicrous is just so aware that Proton's gonna hold his shield, and like you know he's not gonna do anything. Actually, he, he runs off. Does he have it on him already? Oh, he put it yeah, on him there. Yeah, I just saw that. Yeah, yeah that was so good by Lutians. Also, like, off topic, I think it's his birthday today. Oh, yeah, yeah. He told me when we were walking <laughs> here. <laughs> Happy birthday, Happy Lutians. birthday. Let's see if Proton will be the one to kill his birthday wishes, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he did. He, he stuck him literally as he absorbed. That was really good stuff. Yeah, he, he stuck him, but then got hit by the... Uh, the magnet, yeah. Yeah, the magnet hitbox, yeah. Yep. Oh, there it is right there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can even see it's it on, on the... it. It's on his uh, <laughs> stomach. Yeah, it's funny. All right, into game two. I'm not sure. What, oh, they counterpick to um, Proton counterpick to Smashville. Three, see by the little uh, yeah. screen. One, yeah. Go. Not to mention off topic again, but we do have a poll or like a little uh, doc about what we should do with Zeno's rule set. So please check that out. I think it'll help us yeah, a lot. Yeah, if you've been to Zeno, then definitely fill that out because it'll it will help a bunch. Yeah, definitely. Right back into this match. Uh, I want to say like more of a slower approach right now. It seems like both players want to take, or maybe like Proton is trying to pick it some more. Yeah. Uh, I feel like he picked like a more like small stage just to like trap Looney in the corner more. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because uh, on a stage like Battlefield, I feel like he just has like so much room to like uh, just set up, you know. Yeah. Especially with the platforms too to aid like his uh his bombs and stuff. And right now it seems like it's working out 
very well for Proton, 72 to 33 percent. Yeah, I feel like Proton could do a better job at punishing like Looney Tunes, like pulling a grenade. Yeah, I definitely agree. Because at some ranges, you can straight up just dash grab Snake for for pulling a grenade. Because the only way, uh, the only two things he can do are throw it or drop it, and to drop it, you have to press shield. So the grab will just be both options. Yeah, and I feel like. I feel like Proton is definitely adapting more, and it seems like his execution has been so on point. He hasn't been missing any inputs, it seems like. He's, he's been winning most of these exchanges and taking so much advantage of that downbeat. Like, yeah. very, very smart by him. Yeah. Even though he's not, like, punishing the grenade pulls, he's not, like, hitting a shield when he has a grenade in his hand and just taking unnecessary damage. Yeah. And that was a great punish out of shield. Yeah, that scoop. Smash. I didn't know. I didn't even know it went that far. He, he scooped him, like, hand yeah. all the way out and pulled it back in. Yep. Very good. I think this is the first time Proton has a uh, has had a lead. Yeah. So let's see if he can run with it. Shield pressure is very good right there. Mm -hmm. All right. I like how um how Looney Tunes is mixing up his ledge trapping. He's dropping the grenade instead of throwing it up because he just knows Proton's gonna absorb it every time. Yeah. And I'm not sure if Proton knew, but I think if he would have forward through there, the hitbox of forward through would have exploded the grenade and he would have been in armor, and then he probably could have comboed off that. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, honestly. Because I think me Gunner has like a Fox forward throw. Yeah, with the, the involved frames. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the charge shot is going to chill with the Nikita. Wow, nice so heal. good by Proton. Yeah, was right like 20%. Off, yeah, right off the uh, the um, the ledge. Yep. All right, that's uh, both players being on their second stock right now. Yeah. Uh, so far, 40 minutes and 30 seconds. I don't think we're going to see a timeout. Uh, too early to say now, but like, this game has been a slow one. <laughs> yeah. But at the same time, like, what do you expect from two characters who throw throw projectiles at each other? Oh, that was really <laughs> unintentional, but really clean looking. Yeah, he knew Looney's only option there was the shield, and the grenade was behind him, so he could shoot that charge shot, and then it would explode. Yeah, and another thing, when Proton wants up air, uh, the Nikita, it's not going to break it, because uh, he needs to have, like, one big hit, so it might yeah. be a bit hard for Proton to hold the advantage there right now, unless he catches Looney Tunes, like, uh like falling into him, but as you said earlier, like the move is so narrow, it's gonna be hard to hit to begin with, you know? Yeah. Okay. Alright, both players in the reset. Mm -hmm. Not really committing right now. Okay, Looney gonna shield to drop that grenade, then find the grab on the roll. Oh, wow. Okay, he's driving the landing. That was Mash Trap, not gonna find it. Proton looking for something off the slide, trying to get out of this advantage. But the up tilt gonna scoop the landing. Yeah, very smart from Proton. He knows that he has a lead, so he could just stay in the corner and make Snake go towards him. And yep, this wow. loops. Wow, yep. <laughs> as you were saying earlier, I didn't had to see it to believe it, you know? As a, as a trainer, man, that's kind of like down the out of those. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ooh. All right, Chester landing with uh, like not that much charge. Yeah. Uh, it I don't think Proton's been touched. I don't, yeah. I don't think he's been touched since uh, the last talk, either that or he just absorbed a few percent. Yeah. He's playing that advantage state really well, and if uh, Looney was a little lower there, the Nikita would have, uh, not the Nikita, the Cypher would have broke, and then he wouldn't have been able to get another one and make it back. Yeah, but he did air dodge to the ledge, a nice air dodge coming out for Looney Tunes. He's, this is looking pretty grim right now. Yeah. Like, I never want to say it's out because it's like Smash and it's super traditional, but like, yeah. it's looking like we might see a uh, game three right now. Alright, nice combo hop up tilt, yeah. We're gonna fall out, like you said. And Snake's air dodge is just so good, man. Like, <laughs> yeah. it was so far. This is just so hard from a deficit because Proton could just get a couple of heals and then it's so hard to get him to kill for time. Yeah, exactly. Like, uh,. He's just playing so safe, not to mention like if you use one of your, uh, no, whatever your moves the wrong way. He just gets back all that percent. Yeah, yeah. like we said, it's going to be a game three right now. It's the Looney Tunes' as a counter pick. Uh, hard to say if I'll help him out too much, I'd imagine. Okay, Proton's not going to ban. Battlefield is going to ban uh, Yoshi's Island Brawl and Lilat. I ban the same thing. Yeah, I hate slants, dude. We got to get rid of them. Alright, back to Battlefield. There's no DSR, so he could definitely just go back to the stage he won on game one. Yeah, definitely. And this set needs fixing, dude. <laughs> like I said, please fill out the poll, dude. We need <laughs> we need to change this rule set. Anyways, uh, free John numbers again. And 
back to Battlefield. So, what I think if Proton like keeps up the same game plan, uh, I think we'll see something similar to Game Two. It's just it depends on how well Intunes feels with the platforms, you know. Forty this combo, yeah, basically all off that side view is so good. I'm not sure if there's a certain DI to make it not loop as long, but. I mean, yeah, maybe some sort of SDI if I had to guess, but I, could, I couldn't tell you. Yeah, very solid stuff from Proton, though. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> I was going to say, just run him and grab him. Cause yeah, he's only that way too long. That's not going to break it, but I think Proton's looking for damage at that point. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, he pulled a grenade. And that's still a little weaker than, like, usual charge shots in this game, so that's not going to kill yet. Yeah. Okay, he has a nade in hand. It's going to explode. Wow, I like that charge bait you just did right there. Uh, that, wow, that was a lot of explosions and a lot of damage. Yeah, that was like 40 damage right there. Yeah, I didn't okay. even see those right there. The uh, kill throw? The kill up throw, throw, yeah, yep. up throw. I totally forgot about that ever being real. But at like 190, 200%, like, any throw is kill throw at that percent. Yeah. I think right. they buffed it so the shot is like more consistent on the up throw. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because it's like right near her now. Yeah. But, uh, anyways, so... Protom looking for the side B right now. Just gonna get that, see him get that 42% uh, yet again. And he's playing with a lead. He, he was so comfortable with the uh, lead last time, and I felt Lunatune struggled so much. Yeah. Did he stick him? I don't think, he, I don't think he did. No, I don't think he did. It oh, looked, wait. He might have? I don't know. It looked, it felt like he did. Oh, no, he didn't. He would have he done a. Uh, yeah, he would have done yeah. it there. Wow, that was like 25 uh, damage back. Yep. I just can't get over how much he heals. I'm like, it's just such a bad position for Snake to be in right now, you know? Yeah. And I feel like he's healed like way too much because at this point, like if Proton didn't heal, he would have been at like 160% and in like down throw up tilt range. Yeah. But he's just so good at finding these heals. Wow. And that's three slash that one. Uh, after this game, like I'd be curious to see like you have that little monitor like on the windscreen where it's like how much percentage you heal back. That's yeah. <laughs> another 30. I think he might have stuck him. I can't tell. No, I don't think he did. No, he stuck the platform. He's trying to though. Okay, reset, yeah. get up, attack, shields, and then does enough shields to punish it. Yeah, Proton definitely playing this matchup the right way. It started off pretty shaky game one, but yeah. th these adaptions are like, such a long way from That was a really good block string. And when you're coming back from a deficit like this, you really need to focus on optimizing your advantage, but also not taking too much damage on the way. Yeah, because uh, unlike uh, me, Gunner, like, uh, Looney Tunes' damage isn't refundable at up tilt, though. Alright, here we go. Proton still has two stocks to work with. A yeah. fresh one. That was a good 27% combo. Alright, back to the same old, same old, the same ledge trap. Wow, Luigi is letting that, letting that for free. Yeah. And honestly, like 90% isn't really that big, like kill percent for Snake. But playing from this down, like you really need to be careful oh what you're doing. Oh my god, you saw that? That was at yeah. least 30 damage, yeah. That was an oh jeez. <laughs> this is just so unfortunate, but yeah. if he can get those sticks, those have been like working like really well for him. So it just like he can, he's been doing it a lot throughout the set. I want to see him if he can maybe do it a few more times, see if he can get yeah. this W, but right now Proton, he wants this win. I feel like it's a guessing game whenever Proton shields or puts up the uh, magnet. That's gonna be it. Okay, the well, kill sparks, yep, yeah. That's it. Not even close. Okay, red line just pulls up. <laughs> <laughs> red line's just chilling. Red line post up frame one. <laughs> That's a boy. <laughs> oh, I think he's seeing how much he healed. He is. He is. Oh, how much? Hundred three. That's a lot. That's like yeah. at least a stock, you know. Mm -hmm. a